Hi, it's Harvey and Sam here. Harvey here. You sure? Yeah. Hello, I'm Harvey. And I'm Sam. And we are here to give you some help with any literacy work that you're doing while you're at home. And you read, write, ink. That's right. So at school, we do read, write, ink. And there are lots of things that we can do to keep children learning to read while they're at home. And I know lots of parents are really interested in doing that. Yeah, to help you to do it. That's right. So if you have looked in the literacy folder on the OneDrive, OneDrive. then you may have found uh, yes. one of these, but not really known what to do with it. Do I make a bath of it? So Harvey and I are going to show you how it works so that it doesn't make too much of a fuss of it. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. So the complex speed sounds chart looks really complicated and really tricky, but actually it's really quite easy if you remember that each box represents a sound that we use in the English language. They're not in alphabetical order. They are the sounds that sounds we make. make. And Harvey is going to show you what those sounds are like. So we're going to start with the consonant sounds. I'm going to go first. I'm okay, going. are you ready? Yes. Go. Mm. 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 Uh. That's better. Mm. Excellent. So you can see that each one of those boxes represents a different sound. Sounds. And you can see that there are several different ways of spelling most sounds. Okay, so if you look are here. If you look in the box, you yeah. you can spell it with a single F, yeah. a double F, okay. or a PH. a PH. But they all say. Can it sound uh, Harvey, can you find can me the J box? J. This one here. So you've got four different what, ways of spelling J. Spelling? Can you find me the K box? K box is over here. So you've got four different ways of spelling. That's right. Now, there are other ways of spelling those sounds, but they are the most common. Okay? The most common. Now, the other part, so that's at the top of the sheet, no, are no. your consonant sounds. And no. at the bottom of the sheet are your... Vowel sounds. Vowel sounds, brilliant. Okay? Now, these are the ones that Harvey finds a little bit tricky. Oh, they're here for me. Tricky for you. Not for you guys. Okay, so let's try it. We've got a, ah, e, not quite. E, 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 o, 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 ya, a, a. So those first five sounds uh, 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 hard for look me. a little bit tricky. Tricky for me. But actually, not they're the guys. short vowel sounds. A, uh, a, e, e, e. e. Oh, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh. and then the rest of the long sounds. You can do these ones. <laughs> Come on then. What's me? A, E, I, O, U, Banzu, U, R, O. Oh, I don't know. Come on. A, O, Al, Oi, Aya. Eh, yo. Brilliant, Thank well you. done. Well done. So, those are all the different sounds, as brilliantly demonstrated by Harvey. I mean, yeah, baby. And later on, we will make a video that shows how Harvey uses them to help him when he's practicing his spellings. And you guys as well. Okay. All right. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank See you, you later. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh,